New at six, police have just confirmed the name of the 18 year old killed in Des Moines Sunday afternoon. Jaquez Allen was one of three people hit by gunfire on Martin Luther King Jr. Parkway. Another man is in the hospital tonight. Only KCCI's Andrew Mullenbeck talked with a woman who was there just moments after the shooting. So Andrew, what did she tell you? Good evening, Stacy. Neighbors have been telling us that the shooting happened inside the apartment complex here. And what they say is they heard a fight before they heard those gunshots. The first homicide of 2023 came only a few hours into the new year. It was just after one Sunday afternoon, and people in the apartment complex could tell something wasn't good. Nuvasi Charging Crow lives right below where the shooting happened. I didn't see it, but you could hear it. And I just heard some woman screaming, and then all of a sudden there was shots. Police say the shooter used a handgun in self-defense, but it's not clear what led up to the fight. 18-year-old Jaquez Alonzo Allen was killed. This is a photo police released Monday afternoon. We live like right by where like a lot of it took place. And um, when we looked outside, there was a man that was laying in front of our truck and wasn't a good sight to see. She says the deadly shooting at this apartment complex is especially difficult with four kids at home. And for now, she wants them to know as little as possible. I am so thankful they didn't hear. We didn't talk about it in front of them, so they don't even really know. They did see the crime tape, but them, they just think it's a movie. Police do say again that they believe this is self-defense, and as a result, they have not announced any arrests. We're live on Des Moines' north side. Andrew Mullenbeck, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.